When people walk through Buller Catechin, they'll be struck by some visually stunning, captivating artworks, and it's my anticipation that um, that will spark their curiosity, um, their sense of discovery, um, that'll excite them. One of the artists that we're working with is Sohan Ariel Hayes. He's a uh, digital artist and um, that's a very special project. I'm working on a, a new work for Building 360, Buller Catagen, and it's uh, animating the paintings of Shane Pickett across the six seasons. I'm really excited by the use of the point cloud LiDAR scanning in this work and the kind of aesthetic, the way it represents country. And by country, I'm talking about that kind of cultural spirit country, um, which is all the way through Shane's work. There is over 10 art commissions for Buller Catagen. One of the other uh, works that we've commissioned is actually by a Murdoch alumni, Joel Louie. So the work itself is called Collective Resonance, and it really brings together this idea and this notion of the way that we as people um, are uh, interact with one another and that depend interdependency that we have on one another, um, but also the way that we engage with our environment. Every experience is dynamic, every experience is going to be different. Um, and in a way that mimics the way that we view nature as well, our experience of nature. And quite literally, because one aspect of the work is that when someone comes into that space, they're prompted to take a selfie uh, on their mobile. And when they take a selfie, the system grabs that selfie, it goes into the system and they actually become part of the visualization. So um, the visualization consists of a, a particle network, right? a vast array of particles, and they then become one of those particles that's part of the collective visualization. We're working with uh, preeminent nationally recognized Noongar artist Christopher Peace, who is based in southwest of Western Australia. He's creating a really large nine metre long painting which depicts the Belia wetlands that surround our campus. I think that the artworks are quite captivating and visually stunning. I mean, like all our stakeholders in the industry that we've talked to about it have agreed as well that they haven't seen anything like it before. So I think it's a real game changer for the tertiary uh, sector as well.